This is the Google Meet Series 1 Desk 27, developed in collaboration with Avacor. It's an all-in-one premium video conferencing device for small rooms, flex spaces, or hot desking that fits in the home office just as well as it does in the office office. But with a touchscreen and the Jamboard app built in, the Desk 27 does so much more than just run Google Meet. We'll cover that and more in just a few seconds. So today we're unboxing the Desk 27 from Google and Avacor. We're also gonna show you what makes it unique and how to set it up. But first, let's talk about where the Desk 27 fits into the Google Meet Series 1 family. The Desk 27 is made to help a single user meet and ideate with a group as if they were in the same room. Before I show you what I mean, let's see what's inside the box and get the Desk 27 set up. So first up, we have the touchscreen. And this is a 27 inch touchscreen LCD. Next is the stand, but you can also mount Desk 27 on a wall or a, a desk arm. We also have a passive stylus, a privacy shield so you don't have to keep sticky notes nearby, a power brick with region specific power cables, a color matched Type-C cable and Ethernet cable, and lastly, a quick start guide and a screen cleaning cloth. And that's it, now let's put it all together. Now, I can't stress enough how easy this is to put together. If you have remote employees you need to send this out to, you really don't have to worry about having support on hand for anything complex. So first, you connect the screen to the base. It basically just snaps together here. Next, place the stylus on the magnetic dock and place the privacy shield on top. Then connect to power and ethernet, or you can also connect via Wi-Fi. Since your IT admin has most likely already enrolled the Desk 27 in your organization and assigned your calendar to the device in the Google Workspace admin console, there's nothing left to do but turn it on and start your call. And you're done. From box to call, that should take less than five minutes. Now that we have the Desk 27 assembled, let's take a closer look at the actual hardware. Starting at the front, we have the 27 inch touchscreen with a quad HD resolution so everything looks super sharp. Up top is a five megapixel camera that supports 30 frames per second and has electronic pan tilt and zoom. For audio, we have eight onboard mics and this speaker bar with Google's Tensor Processing Unit for accelerated machine learning. Now the Desk 27, like other Series 1 devices, supports true voice audio. This is Google's multi-channel noise cancellation technology that singles out audio from up to 44 sources, removes distracting sounds, and also amplifies voices so that everyone can be heard clearly. And lastly, we have the passive stylus, which never needs charging. It's perfect for whiteboarding in a meeting using the integrated Jamboard app. On the back, we have controls for BYOD mode, screen brightness, and power. And we also have ports including Ethernet, a Kensington security slot, and power. Along the side, we also have a headphone jack, two USB-A's, an HDMI out, and a USB Type-C. Now this USB-C port is one of the best parts of the Desk 27. You can plug in your laptop to extend your workspace while still making use of the Desk 27's camera and audio. Desk 27 will also power your laptop and you can use the touchscreen to control the content on screen. This also represents a major breakthrough for video meetings in that while this machine is built for Google Meet, by plugging your laptop in, you can use the video conferencing platform of your choice. So if you have a vendor or a client that uses another platform, you can join and still use the premium camera and audio from the Desk 27. So that wraps it up for the Google Meet Series 1 Desk 27 unboxing. Be sure to head over to meetingdevices.withgoogle.com for room design guides, deployment guides, and support.